Jonah Larson has gotten national attention for his hobby and his ability to do things at lightning fast speed. Now the lacrosse adoptee is a crocheting machine, but it's what he wants to do with that in the future that caught the attention of some of the most nimble doctors at UW Hospital. That's where Danica Lewis met up with Jonah today. So you yeah, put your hand to this. Yeah. It's safe to say Jonah Larson is more adult than some adults. How long does it normally take to like master this? So when you ask the 11 year old about his future. Well, when I grew up, I wanted to be a surgeon. Yeah, yeah. he is very sure of his answer. Yeah, that's what I'm going to be. It's tough, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> it helps both his parents have medical backgrounds. Did I go through too much here? But it's what he does with his free time that has him thinking he'll have a knack for this. Oh, you push and then out. Yes. Okay. But it's a lot simpler when doing it in crocheting. To test out his career plans, the crochet prodigy is training alongside actual surgeons at UW Hospital. I put it through here to tie it off, though. These tools may not be hooks and yarn, but simulating sutures, sewing up pretend wounds, it feels somewhat familiar. Crochet helps with, like, my hand dexterity. That's another reason I want to be a surgeon. When he said he wanted to be a surgeon, I thought we need to invite him to our Department of Surgery. Did mine become too short all of a sudden? As he's been saying, this is really his priority, is to be a surgeon someday. So what better way than to try it out with us? Could you hold that? Yep. He's incredible. It's a way that to help people, and it seems like it's kind of fun now. Yeah, I see like a long blue vein. Jonah has also decided he wants to go back to his home country of Ethiopia and treat people there. Well, probably not. Easy, but cool. In fact, he's already selling some of his crochet work to help. This is what my future is going to be, so I feel like this is an important thing for me to do. Yeah, it, it is tough, but it's also fun. But even the most mature of 11 year olds. It's been a wonderful experience. Are still kids. And I got a free day of no school. <laughs> Danica Lewis, News 3 Now. I think you probably afford to miss a day. Uh -huh. Along with <laughs> testing out his dexterity, Jonah also got to check out MedFlight and actually teach some of the doctors how to crochet. Thanks to UW Health for these pictures. You can learn more about Jonah's crocheting and charity work through Jonah's Hands over on channel3000.com. Oh, very impressive. And